Okay, we are asked to find the volume of a cone inscribed in a sphere, given that AB is 15 cm and OA is 10 cm. So what I will do, I have to use a formula that will solve the question first and later I will derive the formula. So if we we'll let, let R equal to the radius of the cone and R, big R equal to radius of the sphere and H equals to height of the cone. Then R is always square root of 2 R H minus H square. So I'm saying that if you are to find the radius of the cone is always square root of 2 times the radius of the sphere times the height minus height square. That's height of the cone. So that's the formula for the radius of the cone. Therefore, the volume of the cone now, we know volume of a cone is always 1 over 3 pi r square h. Yes, why r is the radius of the cone, h is the height of the cone. So if we now substitute this as that, we have that, we have 1 over 3 pi r square is now 2 r h minus h squared times h so which is now equal to pi over 3 we can factor h so we now have h squared that's if you factor h so we're left with 2 r minus h so that's the volume of a cone inscribed in a sphere. Yes, so we now use the formula. So from here you see that the height of the cone, AB is 15, Y A O is 10. So we substitute, we have, this is equal to pi over 3 H is AB, height of the cone, AB which is 15 squared times 2 times the radius of the sphere from here is AO which is 10 minus 15 so 20 minus 15 is 5 15 is 15 squared is 15 times 15 so 3 in 15 is 5 5 times 15 is 75 so we have 75 pi times 5 which is 375 pi so our answer is option A so let me now show you how the radius of the cone is equal to the square root of 2 times the radius of the sphere times the height of the cone minus height of the cone square. Let me now prove this formula. Okay, look at this cone, that same cone. So we are given this. We want to get the expression for the radius of the cone, given the radius of the sphere and the height of the cone. So if we call AO, the radius of the sphere which is big letter r as used before in the other question and we'll call okay let's this is bc let's call bc small letter r i know this is perpendicular to that but it passes through the center so again we can join o to c which is also the radius of the sphere so if we join So that is the radius of the, that is also the radius of the sphere which is small 
which is R, big letter R. So these are radius. So remember, I told you, let A, B be the height of the cone. So meaning that O, B will now be H minus R. You get I told you a b is the height of the cone which is h so see what I'm saying let me now write fully so that if let's r be radius of the sphere radius of the sphere small r radius of the cone and h the height of the cone yep so in triangle obc pythagorean theorem h minus r squared plus r squared equals r squared by pythagorean theorem So if you expand this, we have h squared minus 2rh plus r squared plus r squared equal to r squared. So r squared is here. So r squared, r squared. So making this r squared now, which implies that r squared is now 2rh minus h squared. So that's it. Therefore, R is square root of 2 RH. So whenever we're asked to find the radius of a cone inscribed in a sphere, that's the formula.